We continue on our cranial nerve assessment journey as we cover cranial nerves 8, 9, and 10, as our assessment attempts to avoid annoying brain stems by fleeing to the city of sin. First, we review cranial nerve 8, also known as the acoustic or vestibulocochlear nerve, shown in this pygmonic by the brain stem with 8 ball headphones. Cranial nerve 8 is responsible for hearing, balance, and visual fixation during movement. Assess this nerve by testing the ability to hear normal conversation and by conducting the whisper test, both depicted literally. First, be sure to conduct an inner ear visual assessment to ensure no blockages exist, such as cerumen or other foreign objects that could impede one's hearing. Next, let's review cranial nerve 9 also known as the glossopharyngeal nerve, and depicted here as a brainstem with a nine lollipop and glass pharaoh. Cranial nerve nine includes functions such as swallowing and taste sensation for the posterior third of the tongue. Next up, we have cranial nerve 10, the vagus nerve, depicted as the brainstem cleaning the vagus 10 sign. This nerve functions to regulate our heart rate and respiratory drive. It is also responsible for palate elevation, swallowing, and talking. Test this by depressing the tongue and having the patient say, ah, to assess palate symmetry, depicted as the tongue depressor. Additionally, you could test this nerve by touching the posterior pharyngeal, depicted as touching the posterior pharo. So to recap, cranial nerves 8, 9, and 10 are known as the acoustic, glossopharyngeal, and vagus nerves, respectively. To assess all three nerves, check for hearing, balance, swallowing, and gag reflex. Assess man here. I traveled all the way to the city of Sin to escape the brain stems. I was on my way to gamble my troubles away when I heard an irritating voice. Assess man. Ooh, assess man, can you help me? A guitar-wielding brainstem with eight ball headphones sang out. I responded, but he didn't seem to notice. I decided to test his hearing. Can you hear me? I said in a normal conversational tone. Nothing. I didn't really want his attention anyway, so I then moved to a whisper. Can you hear me? I said softly. As soon as I started to walk away, he belted. Help me, assess man, I can't hear anything. Help me if you can. I see the problem. You're wearing noise-canceling eight-ball headphones. Remove those, and you should be able to hear the terrible music you're playing, I said. But he simply replied with a, huh? Just then, yet another brainstem ran out of a candy shop and right by me. He was holding a nine lollipop. Assess man, I fear for my life. I see a glass pharaoh in the shop's window. Are there any real pharaohs in sight? He cried. Pharaohs! For the rest of the story, check out Picmonic.com and sign up for a free account. There, you can also take Picmonic's quiz. The quiz automatically sets up your daily quiz by using spaced repetition algorithms based on the questions you've missed or struggled with to make sure you study what you need. And while you're there, Check out the rest of our head-to-toe assessments pigmonics. We've got all the content you'll need to remember. Everything from cognitive abilities assessment, cerebellar assessment, skull, scalp, and hair assessment, head, face, and neck assessment, eye assessment, and so much more. So you can lock down on everything you need to know forever. Play, quiz, and spaced repetition. Efficient effective, and research proven to increase exam scores.